A Lagos State Governor Babajide Songwolu says reforms have been put in motion to make taxation easier for Lagosians. The governor stated this during the 24th annual Thanksgiving service of the state held at the Tafawabalawa Square, Lagos. Plus TV correspondent Lavi Kukoye Dokun was there and now reports. <laughs> It was a well-attended service graced by all and sundry. Dignitaries from all walks of life, including the immediate past governor of Lagos State, Akinwumi Ambodi, joined the first family in the 24th annual Thanksgiving, dancing, singing, and giving praise to God. <laughs> In his exaltation, the chairman of Lagos State Chapter of the Christian Association of Nigeria, Khan Stephen Adegbite, re-echoed the need to appreciate God for the continuous peace, growth, and development in Lagos State. You feel like jumping, jump. You feel like clapping, clap. You feel like running on the floor, run for the glory of God, because God is alive. Governor Sawon Lu Father brought down the presence of God when he mounted the rostrum. <laughs> Delivering his New Year message, the governor called on the people to continue to commit Lagos State and Nigeria into God's hand for guidance and mercy. And so let us continue to pray for all of our leaders, especially all of us that are in position of leadership at this point in time, that we're leading our states and we're leading our country. We need divine wisdom, we need a grace and to make multitude decisions that will make impact in the life of the people that we have chosen to serve. The governor similarly informed that within the next few months, the formal launch and commencement of operations of the much anticipated red line from Oyingbo to Agbadu would take place. Based on Mr. President's diary, because we are ready, we will also be commissioning the red line. The red line is even bigger and longer and better than the blue line. And so we are committing again that we are 99.9% .9 ready, we are just beginning to do test run. Commissioner for Home Affairs, Olari Waju Layode, said the Thanksgiving service was necessary to appreciate God for his mercies on Lagos State in the past year. For us in Lagos State, we have a lot of reason to be grateful. The year 2023 was an eventful year. We had the election and to the glory of God, it was smooth and peaceful. The same year, witnessed the commissioning of people-oriented and impactful projects by this administration. The theme of this year's Thanksgiving service is The Righteous Shall Give Thanks to Your Name. Love Ikuku Oyedoku, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.